Here in the West, we're blessed with some of the best produce in the country. Beef, marron, seafood and fresh fruits and veggies. But what brings it all together? Is there a dish that says WA on a plate? We're on the hunt for WA's signature dish. The plates from the best home cooks in Western Australia in all the regions are coming together for a great competition to find that one dish that best signifies Western Australia. And it all starts here where the home cooks have brought their A-game to Denmark. Today, four home cooks are vying to create a dish they believe best represents the Great Southern. Hi, I'm Pam Lincoln and I'm cooking a caramelised sweet potato and red capsicum soup finished with Ringwald's goat's cheese. Hi, my name's April Kopp. I'm cooking Mount Barker free range chicken wrapped in prosciutto and spinach with a roasted vegetable tian, grilled WA prawns and a creamy white wine butter sauce. Hi, my name's Emma Donnelly, I'm from Perth and today I'm cooking Great Southern Chiapino. Um, I'm using lots of local produce which I love including crabs from Peaceful Bay. Hi, my name's Claire King, I'm from Narricup and uh, I'm cooking a fillet of beef today um, which I've named a celebration of beef. Helping decide the winner of the cook-off is Chef Silas Massier and local identity Kim Barrow. Each cook will have an hour and a half to prepare and present their dish. Now these prawns you're using, they're local prawns, I assume? Yes, they're huge. They're, they're fantastic, massive. aren't they? No, they're lovely. Some of my produce is so fresh, I've just got it from the veggie patch outside. I've got some basil and I had to peel it, actually had to peel a snail off one of these uh, branches because that's how fresh it is. See, that's restaurant quality, isn't it? Oh, that's a cracker, isn't it? Mm. Yummy flavour. Mm. Four fantastic dishes were presented for judging, all with a taste of the Great Southern. Alas, there can only be one winner, and this year it is the beef with the Thai flavourings. Fantastic. Congratulations. <laughs> now we're off to another region renowned for its fresh and quality ingredients. Well, in Pemberton, this is what it's all about today. These are the contestants for round two of WA's signature dish, heading into the kitchen to do their thing. I think they too are bringing their A game. Four new cooks, four totally different dishes. Hi, my name's Diana Waring Smith, and today I'm cooking a lamb roast stuffed with uh, scallops, served with a lemon dill butter sauce. Hi, I'm Jenny, I'm from Bunbury, and today I'm cooking 0.5 Melbourne Marin toasts, and I'm representing the Southern Forest region. Hello, my name's Alana, and today I'm cooking a poached marin with apple and avocado salsa. Hi, my name's Liz and I'm from Wongan Hills in the West Australian Wheat Belt and today I'm cooking a spicy citrus pork loin. Joining me to judge the Pemberton talent are chefs David Coomer and Sophie Zolikor. Well guys, here we are. This is the pointy end in Pemberton of um, the Hunt for WA Signature Dish. They're our contestants, ready to rock and roll if you like. Um, so on a count of three, I think you better get into the kitchen. One, two, three, go! <laughs> What are you doing here? I'm attempting to truss this roast to try and keep it all together because I've just stuffed it with some scallops. Using local ingredients, they've put their own special twist on four unique dishes. But as to which one best represents our great state, well, that's a matter of taste. So there can only be one winner on the day, girls, and there was a, a, an outstanding winner. We thought the marron poached with a little beurre blanc. Alana's dish uh, is the absolute winner, and thanks so much for it. I'm so excited and so surprised as well because as you say there was four fantastic dishes there and yeah I'm really really, really proud that our produce has shone through.